Hey, happy Wednesday. We're glad you're joining in with us again. Today I want to talk about something important, I believe, to you and I, to all of God's creation. And that's the importance of who you are. It seems like we minimize um, certain human beings from others. Uh, not to get political, but how is it we're looking for life on Mars in microorganisms, but killing babies now at birth in certain states and saying they're not life? We, we measure life totally wrong from what God tells us we are. Uh, I'll put it this way, is uh, during the, the early years uh, before Abraham Lincoln, if you were African American, you had a lesser life. Or if you're Irish, you have a lesser life. If you're white, you have more life. If value men, women, children. All the, we have totally messed it up. See, all people are all God's children. And Jeremiah 1.5 says, I knew you in your mother's womb. And, and he goes on talking about how he appointed us in, in greatness and all this. And if God is placing greatness on us, how do we let people diminish who we are? You're valuable. I don't know if anybody's told you that lately, but you are valuable no matter your gender, your race, even your religion. God loves you, and he wants you to draw close to him. Don't let people push you away for this category, that category, or anything else. You are valuable. Just this last week here in the L.A. area, a young girl, nine years old, was murdered, put in a suitcase, and thrown alongside the road by what looks to be her mom and boyfriend. Man, that child's worth more than that. You're worth more than that. The same God that clothed Adam and Eve will clothe you in your family. The same God that protected Noah and his family will protect you. The same God that delivered Noah and the Israelites wants to, you know, secure you in your life as well. God has a high value on you, but you got to claim it. Quit letting people minimize you for whatever category they're trying to put you in. You are a child of God. Your father is a king and you have royal blood. Claim that today. I trust that if you start to believe that, your life will gain more value because you're letting the person who created you put the true value on Listen, hopefully you got a good home church to go to. Sunday's coming. I hope you get plugged in and someone speaks live for you and tells you your real worth as well, and not the world. If not, join us online or here on our campus or one of our many services. But no matter what, hear this one more time. God loves you. In the case of someone never told you yourself this week, so do I. God bless you. We'll see you soon.